And there are just so many things that I can do on my own at home. And most importantly, they don't involve any toilet paper. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Umi. I'm a solo traveler from Malaysia. And today I'm at my home in Kuala Lumpur. As you probably know, Malaysia is currently under a partial lockdown or as we call it here, the restricted movement order. So what that means is that um, we have to stay at home. Malaysians are not allowed to travel abroad and uh, foreign visitors are, are not allowed to enter the country. Most shops and businesses are closed and um, yeah, so we have to stay at home for two weeks. I know that this is also happening all over the world. So there are many other countries uh, that have also been put on lockdown and people are losing their minds. They're just bored. They don't know what to do at home. So without trying to make light of the situation, because I know that people are dying out there and there are a lot of people who are losing their incomes, they lose their jobs, which is also the same situation with me actually, because um, I have a small business um, where I get paid for every job that I do, which means that if I don't go out to work, then there's no income, there's no money. But fortunately for me, um, I have created enough financial stability for me to not have to go to work every day. And even before I started this business, actually, when I was still working as a waitress and as a retail assistant, I was already financially independent enough um, to be able to quit my job at any time I wanted and stay unemployed for a couple of months or sometimes for half a year where I could just stay at home if I wanted to or um, travel abroad. But let's not talk about that uh, in this video because today I'm going to share with you what I like to do at home when I'm not working. But first, let me just tell you that um, I'm an introvert. So when I'm not traveling, I love staying at home. If not because of the virus, then this situation where you get sent home from work or from school and you can stay at home for two weeks without being judged by people who think that I should go out more, you know, this was something that I used to dream about. I love my own company, which is why I'm a solo traveler because I like being on my own. And I don't even need an entire house. I'm perfectly happy, totally fine with staying in my room the whole day for a couple of weeks. If, if it has everything that I need, if it has a bathroom and food and internet, there are just so many things that I can do on my own at home. And most importantly, they don't involve any toilet paper. So what exactly do people do at home? What do, what do introverts do at home? Why do they love staying indoors so much? Okay, so I'm going to show you number one that I love the most is eating. And you know, the great thing about doing it alone is that no table manners required. Number two, singing. You can do this on the balcony if you want. But I prefer keeping it more private. Number three, reading. There's no better way to spend a quiet day at home than with a good book, a cup of hot chocolate, and a lot of snacks. So, what do I like to read? Uh, everything. I've got all of these here. And all of these right here. Number four, drawing. I'm not an expert, but you don't have to be an expert to have fun. Number five, starting a new project. It can be anything you like. It can be a jigsaw puzzle 
or a cross stitch project. So this is how it looked like before. And after. Number 6. Blogging As you guys probably know, I have a travel blog where I share travel tips and stories. So if you haven't checked it out already, you should do so now. Number 7. Learning new skills I like learning new languages. So how many languages can I speak fluently? Well, only two. But hey, at least I tried. Bonsoir, madame. Comment allez-vous? Sawadee ka. Kaakun ka. Nen, song, sam, si, ha, kok, chet, pa, kao, si. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Kumusta po kayo? Lo siento pero no puedo. Estoy cansada. Number 8. Planning my next trip. As a traveler, I'm always looking for new inspiration. So sometimes I would flip through my travel books or I would look at my world map. Number 9. Pampering myself Number 10. Cooking I love the process of cooking because you get to be alone in the kitchen, be with your own thoughts, take your own time. And then of course, at the end of it, you get to eat what you just cooked. But when I say I love cooking, I'm not saying that I'm really good at it. Well, I guess it's good enough for me. Number 11. Doing some very simple exercise. Number 12. Meditating. If you've never tried meditation before, you should. All you have to do is just breathe. Okay, maybe not. So those are the things that I like to do at home on my own when I'm not working. I hope that you found some ideas on what to do during this quarantine period. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments or suggestions, please write in the comment section below and I will try to answer them in the next video. Bye.